So cool. Hopefully you got a lot from that. Now I want to talk about the feeling aspect, you know. Rhythm is also not, it's, it's feeling and math, you know. There's the math aspect, but there's also the feeling aspect. Um, you know, say if you're playing in a post, you can also play, you know, with the beat, on top of the beat, or behind the beat, for example. Like, if, let's say if this is the beat, and I want to play behind the beat, you know, I can reference the beat with a little hesitation. kind of feel that delayed reaction with the beat. Ah, ah, everything is on this kind of lazy anticipation. But it's beautiful because it gives the beat a little bit more weight, a little bit more hold back. So no matter who's playing on top of it, can do something else. But I can play exactly with the beat. can kind of get that sensation of like I'm right in the middle where the beat is you know it's just kind of like this balancing you know we're both staying directly on the pulse but then I can also play on top of the beat you know just to kind of push it ahead It has a little bit more of a frantic energy that moves it ahead. So it just, it's like a feeling that you can allow, or that you can just, you can interpret and then you can make it a reality in what you're playing. You know, if you want to use that as like, a, say if you feel like the, the tune is a little bit lazy, and maybe you want to push it a little bit, you can just play on top of the beat. Or if it feels right in the middle, you can just sit right on it. It also depends on the bass player. Some bass players play behind the beat, like they take the beat that you play, and they might play behind it. Like, say if I'm playing like this, a bass player can have the option to go, kind of push the beat a little bit. And if you're just listening to the bass player, I mean, he's really sitting on top of the pulse, which is completely different from where I'm coming from. And, that's great within music because you have what is called contrast at this point. And sometimes contrast can really, really be nice. You know, it doesn't always, everything doesn't always have to be completely synchronized because it's most important about the feeling. 